like one question I have is just like with this war, why is it that Israel seems to be like the only country that has to like defend itself for defending itself? Like, I don't feel like other countries have that same position, you know, like, I don't think the US really like has that. Like if we went to war with someone who like we wouldn't or I guess we would drown it out more. Or I don't yeah, know. I think because because there is a or partially because people don't like strong Jews. I think is that what it is? Yeah, it's like anti-Semitism anti is, is still part of it. But I also <laughs> think it's because the Palestinians and, and the leftist intellectuals have done a really, really good job of muddying the history to present yeah. the history as if Israel were the aggressors to begin with. So that this isn't a war of, of, of self-defense. It was the Palestinians on October 7th who were acting in self-defense because the people who started this and the people who were really brutal, the people who were really awful, the Israelis. And so I, I, I think that they've so muddied the history and, and there's so much perverse uh, moral, uh, you know, altruism is so perverse in terms of how to evaluate the sides that, that people just don't know how to make the evaluation. And, uh, and it gives a certain credibility to the idea that the Palestinians are just fighting for their own freedom as if they, if they, they have any conception of freedom. Thank you. Sure.